Hey, what's up going on everybody? RangerFan2177 back here with another NCAA 12 Let's Play. <coughs> and today we're going to jump back into our dynasty mode with SMU. We are the offensive coordinator. And uh, I apologize, this is game two of the season. I played game one, tried to upload it. This was There was an error. So uh, this is game two. We all want to know we'll be facing the UTEP Miners at home. And uh, I could have sworn I... Okay, I... I did eliminate all of the play choosing and super sending for the rest of the video to the exception of what just happened and so we're gonna have a we're gonna run the draw play right off the bat here and we will pick up the first down after a couple of broken tackles there and our running back is good and pay attention in the future for us utilizing our tight end because he is a good he's a good ball player and so uh, we're gonna go run with the play action right here we're gonna fake it to the halfback we're gonna be looking for x our tight end on the smash route but he doesn't even try for the ball right there uh, that does happen to me a few times in this game and the next game combined. Uh, I should be uploading that next game today. And so we're going to run the ball here. We're going to try and go inside. We're just going to get caught up in the pile, everybody. We're only going to pick up three yards. Um, Andrew Anderson's our guy's name. Oh, for 45 seconds in the game, we got a third and seven right here. We need to convert. We don't want to go three and out to open the game. So we hit circle on the curl route. It was designed to be an in route, but he stopped. So I, I found a hole in their zone, and I hit him for the first down. So we are about four minutes left in the first quarter. Um, we're on the opponent's side of the field. We got a first down. And we're going to drop back right here. We're going to pump fake. And then we're going to hit circle on that curl once again. Um, unable to break a tackle, but he is able to pick up the first down. So we got first and 10 from the 30 with just under four minutes left in the first quarter. And let's see what coach is dialing up right here. He's going to dial up the four verticals. Yes. And I don't know why it took so long to call that play. And Circle runs a curl out again, and he's wide open. And I'm going to give it to him. He's going to slip one tackle. He's going to be forced out of bounds inside the five. So that'll set us up first and goal for SMU. <coughs> About three minutes and 35 seconds left. Uh, we got first and goal. Guards pulling. We're going to hand it off to the halfback, and there's just nowhere to run right there. So if anything, a loss on the play, yes, minus one yard. So we got about three minutes left in the first quarter. Second and goal. And... I go for him across the middle. He didn't catch it anyway, but he was out of bounds regardless if he would have caught it or not. So I do, I'm do. i going to hop route X right here for a slant the opposite way on third and goal. And as you can see, he just finds a hole in the zone. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> That's wrong. I'm thinking of a different juncture of the game. So they, they stop us on third and goal, but we do kick the field goal. So up three to nothing. Our defense holds them. So now that two minutes again, we dial up the draw once again. He's going up the middle using this blockers break and tackle us for another nice game for a first down. <laughs> So we're on, our own we're on our own 46 with just under two minutes left on first down. And I do believe this is another one play. Yes, we're going to dive to the left. Nearly drops back, hands it off, and I go for the right side. Anticipating the fact that my fullback would ISO that backer the other way. But he breaks off and makes the tackle. So we got second and seven here, a minute and a half left. We're on the play action. We're looking for X on the smash route. Uh, Rover makes a great play. They do a 3-3-5 uh, defense at this point in the dynasty. So um, we're going to call the slip screen right here on third and seven. I'm going to drop back the other way, throw it to him. He's wide open. He's going to use his blockers. And he's going to get dragged down just past the first down marker. So we do indeed have a first down. So we, at this point, we have less than two minutes left. We've got about a minute 15 left in the first quarter, winning three to nothing. <coughs> Coach dials up the play action on first and ten. So we're going to drop back. We're going to be looking for L1, and he just makes a hellacious catch over two defenders. And that'll put us inside the 20 yard line. That was just a great catch by the receiver right there. Going up and get it. Going up and getting it between two defenders. So we're going to dial up the run here with a minute left. And uh, this pretty much has nowhere to go either. I mean, we did get three yards, but really wasn't an, <coughs> an outstanding run. Sorry about that. That is your backup running back, Justin Jones. So we're dialing up the slip screen right here. But I do, yes, I hot route X, excuse me, the bubble screen. X finds a hole in the zone, and there's just nobody there. That's the play I was talking about. That's a touchdown. That's our tight end. Excuse me. That's our running back audible. I don't believe that is our tight end. You'll have to look out for our tight end in the games to come. He's very good. So defense holds him. We just started the second quarter. I'm going to try to pump fake Sluggo to circle, and he does not make a play on that. There's four defenders. I was just, I was just lucky for that ball not to be intercepted. So uh, we're dialing up the draw here just in the second quarter, up 10 to nothing. And I didn't didn't anticipate the D tackle to spin off my guard that fast and make a play, but we still got six yards, so it's not that bad. We got third and four right here. Um, coach is dialing up the play action. 
and uh, I was going to go X, and the quarterback falls forward right here for a great play and a first down, and uh, that's just, that's that's good stuff right there. Uh, I was looking for X, he was covered, so I scrambled for the first down, and uh, so I coached down to the play action here on first down, and see right there, like, he just ran right across the field, and he was wide open, and like, I even tried to use him to catch the ball, and just for some reason it wasn't even close, but I don't know. So I'm dialing up the bubble right here again, but I'm going to hot route my tight end. Um, I hit him. He goes up the field. <coughs> Pick up about 20 for a first down. We've got about four minutes, roughly four minutes left in the second quarter. And we're winning 10 to nothing. And we're coach dialing up the play action right here. We're going to fake it to the running back. we got X and Triangle running flat routes. And we're going to hit Triangle. He's going to slip one tackle, break another one. Tackled. At about the 29-yard line for another first down. <coughs> Excuse me. Hold on. Sorry about that. It's my little brother. So we're going to dial up the draw here. We get the ball. We're evading through tacklers. And that'll be a pickup of eight, I believe. Yes, it is. So we have second and two. About three minutes and 20 seconds left. We'll win 10 to nothing. That was indeed our first string running back. And so Coach has dialed up the play action once again, which has been very successful this game. We're going to be looking for... We were looking for X on the smash route, but the pressure got to us. Just lucky to get that one off. As you can see, we're 3 for 4 on third down today, which is not too shabby at all. We're going to hot route X once again on third down, and he he had a hole. I'm going to throw... I'm a, I'm, it was it was originated for circle, but it, didn't, it did not hit circle at all. It actually actually threw it to X. So, uh, Coach is down with the play action again. Three minutes left, and uh, we fake it. And I'm looking for triangle and just they they just swarm to the ball and they don't get him. Yeah, they don't get him, excuse me. We did not get the touchdown. That was our fullback, Matt Silva. So we got about roughly <coughs> two minutes left. I'm calling the mesh play right here. And yes, we're gonna find him in the back of the end zone for a touchdown. That is our tight end. He is very good. And uh, you will see. And he looks good. <laughs> no homo with the uh nice helmet and the visor, so uh and this, I just run this play to perfection. I remember this. I'm rolling out under two minutes left. Right when Square comes back, he comes back to the ball. Tackled as soon as he catches it, but not before Mustang first down. And so, we got a minute and 40 seconds left in the half. And, uh, <coughs> trying to get some points on the board before half. And, uh, we got a solid run right here. Three yards, but we did make some people miss. So, not, not, not the worst thing that could have happened. So we got second and seven under a minute and a half left. The play action. I'm looking for circle on the corner route once again. Rover makes a great play. Those Rovers were all over the ball all game. So third down. We're still four for five on third down. And the draw, there's just nobody there. And they completely bite on the pass. And so that'll be a pick up for a first down. And uh, we're hurrying up our offense. We got a minute and 17 seconds left. And uh, it's first down. And... Uh, I throw it up the circle right here, and uh, he just comes down with it. That, he's a great receiver. You'll see him in the future. Him and our tight end are uh, most utilized receivers. This guy just puts on a show this game. Uh, short routes, uh, yards after catch, and the deep boy puts on a show this game and next game. You'll see that game later today, hopefully. So we got under a minute left. We're still trying to put more points on the board. I find him on the corner route. He breaks a couple tackles, pushed out of bounds with 35 seconds left. We're inside the other team's 30 at this juncture of the game. So we're winning 24 to nothing. Second half is winding down. We got first down. We're looking for X on the smash route, double coverage, and this ball is just incomplete. <coughs> I was really just hoping for a throwing up and uh, for a prayer right here just now. So we got four verticals right here. And uh, I don't know why I didn't throw it to circle. He had his man beat on the inside release. But regardless, that, that ball's deflected. So we're still five for six on third down. We're pretty successful on third down today. So we're going to run, uh, Square's running a post, X is running a go. So we're going to throw it up to X, and he does not beat the safety. So that's incomplete, and we are forced to kick a field goal, and it is incomplete. Incomplete, excuse me, a field goal is no good. So defense gives up a touchdown, open up the second half. I'm going to hit circle over the middle right here. Thought I was going to hit him, just didn't even try. So we're winning 24 to 6. We got about three minutes left in the third. Second down. Coach is dialing up the play action once again. I'm looking for circle. He catches it. And as you can see, he's gone. <coughs> yes, he's gone for a touchdown. That is Nixon again, once again. The guy that caught the jump ball earlier. 
Like I said, he can do the short passes, yards after catch, or the deep ball. This guy is good. As you can see, we broke, he broke the record for the longest pass. I don't know if these records are real. I don't know what EA is doing, but most of the time it just seems like they're not accurate. So we're up 31-6 to six at this juncture of the game. I'm kind of just trying to drain the clock out. And uh, we break one tackle, but we're tackled for a gain of four. As you can see at the clock, I've got the, as you can see on the clock, I've got it on conservative to chew the clock out. So, uh... I'm trying. To, I'm trying to just run the timeout, and we break a tackle there. And this guy just. This guy just runs hard. He's a downhill runner, north and south. He does not try to cheap spin. He will if necessary, obviously, but uh, he just likes to get downfield and uh, run people over. And so uh, I'm looking for something outside right here. We break a couple tackles. We still get one yard. So uh, third quarter's winding down. I do believe. Yes, it is. Winning 31 to six, and uh. I'm just running up the stats right here, so I've dialed up the play action. All their backers bite, and I'm looking for square across the field. He comes down with it, tackled inside the five-yard line. That's Nixon once again. He's got to have over 150 receiving yards this game. He's got a couple touchdowns. So, uh, start of the fourth quarter, I cut out the transition to the fourth quarter. I'm trying to run up the stats again, and that's Karma saying, just run the ball. And uh, I get sacked right there. And I dial up the play action boot screen here just into the fourth quarter. And this this just works to perfection, I do believe. Yes, it does. Quarterback, I don't know how he manages to get rid of that ball, but he does. And there's just no nobody's anywhere around to make a play. So we're up 38-6. to six. We get the ball back with great field position again. Got under three and a half minutes left in the ball game. And so we're going to hand it off and try a run once again. And there's just nowhere to go for our second screen halfback. And he stopped at the line of scrimmage, Justin Jones. <coughs> Winning 38-6, to six, just inside three minutes. I'm going to dot the play action once again. X is wide open on the smash route. Nobody around him. That is not. That is our tight end, Baker. He is. He's a ball player. So, uh, like I said, look out for him in the future on our dynasty mode. And um, so we're going to try and run the clock out again. We're just over two minutes. There's a lot of room to run. We got our guard getting out there, getting the, blocking that corner. That's a great play right there. Is he going to go all the way? Could he slip it? No, he's tackled inside the 10, guys. Great run. We got a first and goal. We're on the 9-yard line. We got about a minute and a half left in the game. We are going to win this, obviously. We're winning 45-6. to six. And this is our third team halfback now. And we hand it off to him, and he's got nowhere to run. Poor guy. Finally gets in, gets a snap, and he's just stuffed at the line. So we got under a minute left. I do believe I audible in the play action right here. Yes, I do. And I don't know if I get another touchdown. I circles open on the smash. I throw it, but no, that's deflected. And uh, I'm pretty sure I do get another touchdown. But uh, hold on, got about that under 45 seconds left. And uh, yeah, I'm tackled inside the one. And I do believe, yes, I, j I just let them kick the field goal. They cement the game's over. All right, guys, I don't have much time to <coughs> get this out. But I started an online dynasty for my YouTube subscribers. So I want you guys to go search for it it's called youtube go join creator my uh psn name is texas ranger 3221 i'll put it in the uh description so join only seven teams are allowed this is strictly for my subscribers it's not private so i want you guys to go over there and join because i got uh remember this is ps3 and ncaa 12 so you guys i need you guys to go over there and join i realize there's no gameplay flowing right now but I want you guys to go over there and join that online dynasty. Thanks.